Yep, this one is left, maybe going to catch the left rough. Hundred and forty nine yards. Great line this left rough. Shouldn't have any issue here. Just gotta keep it left of this hole location though. Anything right will fall off the green. Now this is left of the flag. Good shot. I like what he did there. Just kept that club face open, just trying to that little squeeze fade. Okay, Spieth for Birdie at eleven. Ten, excuse me. Yeah, pretty Pretty flat, got a little push to the left right there. Should maybe straighten. Nice speed on his first putt. Speed. And this one right at the bunker. Have to see if it's got enough. Oh yeah, no problem. <laughs> now this one coming in low. Oh. Oh. It's almost even lower <laughs> down in that cup. Jordan Spieth on the tee at 12. That's about 275 over the left bunker, back a little bit into the breeze. Want to avoid that left bunker today. That's a no-no. A and this one is no problem for Jordan right down the middle. Yeah, it's been nice, hasn't it, to watch the rhythm of the swing. Well, this high drifting left. Uh, is it going to catch the ridge? Nope, going to stay on top. Got a beautiful view from behind. Oh, oh there we go. Jordan Spieth. Well, you had that out there about four or five feet, I think, John. That was a spectacular putt. This on a really good line if it's enough. Sit, sit. Oh my God. Ooh, that'll be a test up. <clears throat> a little bit of a roller coaster chip up and over some slopes there. Jordan Spieth with his chip on 13. That right there is, well, that's what he does. He gets out of position, always mixed, gets it up there real close. Easy peasy. Oh, Jordan. Well, now this is left. It's so hard to commit uh, to, to hit it across that corner. You know you don't want to blow it right. Especially if you can't get it green side. This one left right, coming on. in pretty flat. Maybe a good high. Oh. What a shot. What a shot. That was pretty spectacular right there. You know, being up the left-hand side, even though he was in the rough, it gave him a great angle to hit a little cutty back to that whole location. That was nice. Kind of toward the back portion of the green. Well, I actually went to the right a little on him. Maybe one that just got away there, but... This will get him the three on the par. Uh, nice to, go. to say, I, I like that length birdie putt right there. <laughs> Jordan Spieth on the 15th. Yeah, 297 to the bunkers on the right. Take it right at those with a little draw. And that's exactly what Jordan has done here. It's been good to see, isn't it, uh, John? Moving it both ways at will. That's a very good sign. Yeah, he's just, he's swinging with so much confidence right now. Steve Stand, looks please. in really good form. Still takes a little bit of control away from the player, but this is just right turning in a great line. Mm, fantastic. Right. Wow, that got left in a hurry. He played that thing yeah. a foot out and it, it broke three feet. 
Yeah, nicely done there. I like the I like the speed of his routine now. It seems like it's back to the old Jordan speed. He's very decisive and ready to go. And this one uh, just left of the flag. Good shot. No, 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 sit. Okay. okay. Yeah, sitting in some of this dormant Bermuda is not going to really pose any kind of problem with this ball rolling through this foot and a half or so of fringe area. It looks like it just popped a little right. And look at that's just like Woodland came up a fair amount short there. Uh, it looked like a little bit of a pull. Watching that putt ahead through the ball there. It didn't look quite as smooth as we've normally seen. Yeah, I, I like this play for Jordan. I mean, as good of a wedge player as he is, put the ball in the fairway, give yourself a chance to attack. This up on the right side. This is a pretty aggressive layup, but that's going to create a nice little angle there for Jordan to try to get to this middle left hole today. Yeah, he's only 80 yards, about 74, 73 to the top of the ridge. I think that's got to be kind of a landing spot. Coming in low. Uh, it's just precision with the wedges. He's pretty good at that. Yep, nicely done. What a game. Ryan Palmer drives the green, makes par. Jordan wedge play, makes birdie. Okay. Jordan Spieth off his fourth birdie of the day on the tee at 18. Now this, I think, probably the hardest tee shot they faced this morning, and this is a beauty by Jordan. He is just rocking right now. He's on all cylinders, all systems to go. Looks like he's elected a hybrid. Now, now after all that, he Should decides to right lay it up, up the right side. That's going to be in good shape. Ryan Palmer played before Jordan and laid it up in the left little creek here in the penalty area. So trouble here at the 18th for Ryan. 71 yards for Spieth. This has got to really look good to him, especially with that back slope and the wind in his face. It's coming in low. He's oh, trying to Sid, use it. Spin too much. Here it comes. Sit down. Texas kid knows how to play that shot. I love how he flights his wedges. It's very impressive to watch that. We, we've seen it now for so many years, and he was licking his chops. I, I, at first, I'm thinking 71 yards might be a little too close, but uh, not at all. That was that was well done. <laughs> Five, I, I, I get where you're going here. <laughs> Just faith for birdie. Yeah. Oh, my. Well, I'd say uh, Jordan Spieth's feeling it. About 310 is a, is a perfect tee shot distance-wise where it starts to kind of pinch in. Players going with less than driver straight down breeze here today at one. Eight yard downhill as Sit well. Hard. Please don't hit and the car path. Please don't hit the car path. Begging you. Uh, golf ball did not listen. No, well, it's not ideal, but it could be a whole lot worse. Let me tell you, 188 he's got. He's actually yes. got a window to go low left and hit kind of a, a cut shot. So he's about 160-ish. Okay, Thank you. 160 ish to the front of the green. If he carries this, I think around 170 to 175, that should carry the bunker and everything kind of feeds back. So, all that to say, he's got a shot. It's all you need. Yeah, there's a rock about six inches behind his ball. His left foot's on a rock. So, th this is the, uh, the perils when you get off the fairway here at the Oaks course. You know, it started left, it's cutting. This is on a good line. If it's enough, it may have to get up. Yeah, I'm going to catch the collection area, so that'll be a tricky up and down from there. Yeah, this is going to require all kinds of magic here. A little down slope. Oh, that's why he's one of the best in the business right there. Good look at how open he stands. Down there. Jordan Spieth would like to keep doing what he's doing so far today. Well, he has really been swinging this club well, and that's another shot that's leaking a little right, but 
got away with it, John. Yeah. Jordan Spieth, his second. Yeah, Jordan from 283. This ball sitting down just a little bit. This is probably going to be a chaser. Oh, no, Jordan. Come on, man. Uh -huh. Tried to double cross there. Yeah, he definitely looked like he was set up to hit a cut there. Not what he wanted, John. Well, the one on the first hole I thought was pretty difficult, and he made that look easy. This is, uh, I'm going to say, to get it close, about a 9 out of 10. Well, he took the risk of leaving it short like that to get it close and just missed his carry by about two yards. Yeah, coming up a little rise right about there, and it should work down to the right. Oh. Beautiful pace on there on that pup. Well, on a good line, really good. Yeah. Quality golf shot there from Spieth. Little down right to left for Jordan. <laughs> you could tell five feet from the hole that that thing was going in. Absolutely perfect pace. So we go back to the tee at four. Jordan Spieth. Yeah, tough tee shot here today at the fourth. Down off the left. This one drifting up the right side. Oh, that was not a good kick. Come on. <laughs> that second kick was a pretty good one to save it getting in the rocks potentially. Okay. So we can see where Spieth's ball ended up. Yeah, he's got 137. Flies pretty clean, nice and firm under the ball. And this on a really good line if it's the right club. Sit, sit. Jordan. Ah, dang. Jordan Spieth for birdie at four. Pretty good left to right movement in this one. Coming off a little slope there. And Needs to go a little. Speed to safe par. A little forward press for him, but nothing like Palmer. Down breeze off the player's right today. And this one heading right, actually right of that bright bunker. I couldn't actually see where it landed. Yeah, and got a good kick, John. He's in the fairway. 112, maybe. Let it balance and check. Get down. Get on the ground. Just like this. There's that runoff. Missed his spot by about five yards there. Now, Spieth. Well, back into the breeze, but contact there, not his best, still not all that bad. I think the upslope into the wind helped that ball stop quickly. Jordan Spieth to save par. Yeah, big par save here for Jordan. It's about the length he missed back at 16. No problem here, though. Nicely done. This is a little draw. low, quick draw here for Jordan. He's going to need some luck. Like straight, right? Yeah. Man, he got, like he straight. got it. He got some luck there and a great lie. Clean enough lie, you think he'd take this one right at it. And this is nope. right at it, a little left, actually. But Don't oh, stay there. Oh, that's got to settle down. Came into me. Feel that right now? Don't go in the bunker. Oh my God. Feel that, right? Wow, that's unfortunate there. I played it to be straight off the right or a little help and then it shot up into and it flew five yards short. I was gonna just play it at those camera guys with a low draw. And then when we were feeling that wind, I had to change the shot. Wow, that was a bad beat right there, Michael. Total flip. 
right when I hit too. Like if I'm hitting sooner, it doesn't happen. And if I wait 10 seconds longer, I step off of it and play a different shot. That was a bad beat. Spieth from the bunker on six. <laughs> well, <laughs> that was not easy. That hole, that was a false edge. If he doesn't hit it far enough, it's coming all the way back to him at, at his feet. Spieth with just a little bit of tidy up work. Another good up and down for Jordan. Now he's going to hit perfect golf shots, so. Wow, this is just you got to be kidding me. Block out to the right. Holy smokes, that got hit hard. Very interesting lesson of Jordan, is it? A ridge from the right of the hole that's going to come off of that, gather some pace, but it's a big swinger from right to left. Pretty well judged right here. Oh, I would say great pop from Steve. Nicely done there. Managing his way around. Yeah, it starts center, cutting to the right, Green, trying to hold it. Jordan, are you serious? It's pretty clean. So I'm just cutting it. Can't really go right because I think it could get up right into this tree. Yeah. Yeah, you know, both he, Jordan, and Ryan have some lip issues here with this fairway bunker, so they're going to have to, I think, keep it well back here, so they're going to have a long third shot to what you guys have already described as a diabolical hole location. Now it's out clean, pretty high, but again, this is going to be well back for his third. Yeah, I know. It's I think the right it's this play. Club, yeah. it, I got three behind it, right? Yep. And then if it holds, that's already playing that number, so it should hit short of that. Yep. Okay. All right. Well, kind of hear all that from Jordan and Michael Greller. Right, cool. How's it going? Really, like yep, no need, need to challenge this back hole location. Anything in the middle of the green short of this ridge is going to be an acceptable shot, I think, for Jordan. That is a heck of a shot right there. <laughs> yeah, this is a great look here after this third shot. Pretty flat. Maybe move to his left. We didn't, did he? Yes, he did. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, maybe that's what you have to do. Lay up way back on number eight. Give yourself a better look at this back hole location. on number nine. Oh, and this one's way right, guys. This is going to be in the trees. Hang on. Yes, it looked like it made the tree line there, and now you're in the lap of the gods. But Jordan, after his tee shot, they found the ball. Now, what does he have down there, John? Yeah, he's, he, he's, he's just on the, the proper side for a right-hander. Uh, to be on this side of the tree. He's got an, he's got a shot as we kind of listen here, seeing 75 foot. And there you go. He actually has a play to go kind of low, like a low, hot cut shot. Stay short of the green. Tell you, he's caught a couple of pretty good breaks today when he's found. Yeah, I mean, obviously, sort of native area. I'm probably staying under that. Yep. If it's in question, I'll to punch out, but. No, and I don't need to work to keep it under that. Okay. So okay. it's yep. actually more important to make sure it's getting high enough when I'm playing this punch so it doesn't hit a rocky. Okay. 75 front? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right, let's see that picture. Okay, so he's got a swing of it. He's got a gap. Can he execute? 
stand on a rock. Awkward stance. Oh, this comes it's out a rock. great line. This is a really good, good looking shot. shot. Right. Well, I might have oh, that's pretty good play from there. Actually, I did ruin my floor. I might want to buff that out, Jordan. You think I didn't go down harder? Mm -hmm. We've seen some brilliance from Jordan today around the greens. And that one just didn't come out with the tumble that he was expecting. Impressive effort, a very impressive day's golf. Maybe not the control he wanted 100%, but he got the most out of his round. And a really, really good start to the Solera Texas Open. Five under par, 67. He had a lot to smile about today. You gotta get out the second hand fingers to count those birdies. Seven birdies, just a couple blemishes. Really, overall, a great day. But this says a lot. You know, he didn't have to hit a lot of fairways. He didn't have to hit a ton of greens. 23 putts. You're doing a lot right there. Trying to get a little bit less stuck underneath. Is it going to move on the wind enough? Yeah, nicely done. Yeah, good start there. That's perfect. That is a Texas boy bounce, isn't it? <laughs> Slight upslope there as well. That won't be too bad at all. Bounces it uphill, downhill. Oh, it's pretty salty. Mm. How close his hands are. Okay, a birdie, birdie start for Jordan Spieth. Smart movie, wasn't fully committed, backed off, brought Greller in, discussed it a little bit more. Sounds like he's just going after Go it a hard. little bit more. Go hard. Go hard. That spawn, it got gusted. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it just I mean, it smoked it, it just got straight gusted. That's very fortunate. I mean, I, that's 25 yards short of how far that can yeah, right now I think it might be. Yeah, you have to believe that Jordan's shot influenced him a little bit. He got fortunate. Can he take advantage? Just like yesterday, when he got himself in a little bit of a bind, got himself out of it. Really solid start for Jordan Spieth, looking for his first victory since 2017. Two number five to that left bunker. Lovely free flowing follow through there. Through the ball was terrific. Nicely done, right down the middle. Jordan Spieth is second. Oh boy, that ball did not. What the heck? Something would tell me it's sitting down just enough. You can see only half of the ball. Came out rolling pretty good, though. Hey, I guess he knows what he's doing. Yeah, I think he's, he's kind of figured it out at the moment. Such a great chipper and pitcher of the golf ball. Certainly 
was something there that made him pull that club. This line's going to be that left bunker in our in our screen. That's almost green sides, 360 to it. Thanks. Boy, he is swinging the driver well today. Love to see the quick pickup of the tee. That's way down there. Perfect tee shot. Good angle. Getting it figured out. He is so close. Yeah, if you're a griller, you just agree, right? Yeah. Hang on. Go. Get lucky. Ask and you shall receive, buddy. Yeah, he'll be happy when he gets up there and sees that. Spieth, good lie. 101. Very fortunate to be where he's at. It's softly, real softly. It'll be good. Going off the right side of the green. Just didn't come out of my bank. Stay right. there, okay. 78. Yeah. A lot of character around the edges. It's just a really well-designed golf course. Okay. Great speed. I think he'll take it. Yeah, it's amazing how quickly expectations change. Once you see you've got a wedge in your hand, all of a sudden you start thinking three instead of six. Yeah. That's why. Oh, it's too much. Don't plug. Don't plug, don't plug, don't plug, don't plug. Oh, it definitely didn't plug. Well, we don't have to wonder. Well, he was trying to ride the wind. He said a wind rider, and he did. I think that must have kicked off the, the bunker lip and kicked way away from the hole. Um, this is going to be tough. Yeah, much more difficult than if that ball had just gotten in the bunker. Oh, I threw it way up in the air. It's a great shot. I tell you, if you, got, you see a ball spin that much out of a bunker, that means he was in, intentionally trying to spin it, which means you're hitting the ball first. Doing pretty good with the flat stick. 22 of 23. And it just goes in at that gingerly pace every single time. So many good signs for Jordan Speed to see him take on shots and execute shots that. Hmm, surprised how much height he put on that. Thought he might have taken that a little bit lower. Might just move it a little bit right to left. Hmm. It did. of the tee, hitting it right by Ryan. Take that, RP. Softly, softly. Jeez, same thing. Oh, it was definitely off the right, it was definitely blowing. Yeah, I think he's got it, you know, on that eye height on the green. He, he's reading this thing like a putt. Mystery, Jordan. Not the pieces rolling these parts, aren't they? They're, they're, they're just rolling in, not too soft, not too hard. Four! There's 
the white. All right. Stop it. Go on the wind. That wind coming, Michael. Never saw it. What do you think that 67 is playing the hole? 87. Point yep. further. Yep. Carry at 90. Uh, can you just keep your hands down? Mm -hmm. Sorry. Thank you for the help. Help my hand. Kid getting dragged off. <laughs> Are you going to try something stupid? It's the perfect line for a cut. You can take it right down the line of that cart path. Parallel to that line. Look at this. Oh, oh, yeah. Great shot. Great shot. Gary Woodland territory there. And Gary Woodland chose a, to chip it. Jordan chose to putt it. Now, like you say, he, he's putted it. That's the second time from the rough we've seen him. Yeah, I'm not really sure about that play, especially to this back right hole location. You think going up to the left would kind of open the green some, but. We're gonna find out if it's right carryable. In the middle God of the bunker. Dang, that's right in that lip. Go! Oh, oh. oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, 148, actual number. Oh, I left it wide open. Holy oh, this smokes, is that way bad. right. Not committed at all there, Pugs. He also got smoked by Wynn. No. Back to Spieth, his third. Yeah, all kinds of problems here. This is pretty good play yeah, considered exactly to get it right, right to landed. there. That's been doing it better, huh? pretty good shot. Jordan with his putt here for par. Boy, what a save this would be. Down the hill, working right. Really unfortunate considering where he was off the tee. Yeah, couldn't capitalize on that good break off the tee. Jordan Spieth has done a good job of that today. That's an I jinxed that him. Back out with Jordan Spieth after that tugged tee shot. Left, isn't it? Yeah, right. Well, pretty this is heading left. Better than I think in that bunker for sure. Man, should be just a little pitch and run shot here for Jordan. Not a whole lot to this. Uh, may need to settle. from that marker. Yeah, no harm after the less than stellar tee shot. Farther than the number. Yeah, he started this one left and this Sit one down. trying to drift Sit back. Sit down, softly. Oh my God. You know, it flew the green, landed over and went too. long. It was back there. Try to hit it easy and you I mean, just absolutely flush it. We must have caught no wind, it. dude. Oh, feel that? Wow, that's downwind. Yeah, he sounded like he caught that a little heavy, but... Go, 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 go. Oh, he hit a good putt. Yeah, hit a good putt. Sometimes good putts don't go in. This up the left and kind of hanging right there. Got 
really worried about that tree mid back. Quit it! Just came out of the right in the bunker. And if it gets far enough in there, it shouldn't be too bad. Pretty straightforward, John. Yeah, this is pretty straightforward on the proper pin high there, so not much slope to work with. Uh, this looks like a pretty good play. Yeah, definitely one you'd expect to get up and down more often than not. Yeah. Confident stroke there. Another good up and down. Now this started right at their left One center, hop. turning One hop. just left. It may need to get a little further. Wow, what a hop that was. Sure. Sure. Thanks. It certainly was. It's all about the ask. You know, you ask properly, that ball will like you more. This is a green light opportunity for Jordan. It's just right of the flag. A foot right of the flag. That is fun. When you get a distance dialed in, as good as he is with those wedges. He never misses those. All right, got the two shots back that he dropped a few holes ago. Sit. Now this Down. on a good line. Softly. That got gusted too. Sit. That'll come Shush, back. Okay. I don't like this. The nice thing about this green, it's big. Backstops are your friend. Nothing he can't handle, however. Space for birdie. Look pretty much the same put that Japan. So that was a good lag. Make quick work of it with Jordan Speed, driver at 17. Yeah, 331 back into the wind, so really no chance to reach this green. Let's go, Jordan! I'm going with driver, though. Leaning like it's a little right. Get out of that lip. Well, clean line in the bunker, but. Not ideal. He kind of chuckled at me when he took a look at it and said, this is not where I wanted to leave this shot. Now, this didn't hit it flush. It's got to get up. Now, that is mm -hmm. hard. Right, Jordan. OK, Jordan Spieth, his third. Oh! oh. <laughs> I was just going to say that's chip inable, but uh, if that pin won there, it might have gone in. That's cruel. That was kind of wild. He had a left-right kick. That was interesting. He told it not to go, and then it, it went the other way. Huh? And just a smother run up the left side there. It's actually going to be a pretty good play. Yeah, from our vantage point, looks like he's OK. Well, there you go. Taking it up in the air. And trying to wow. use the trajectory to stop it, and that was a little surprising from Jordan there. Yeah. 29 and a half feet for speed. Yeah, it's, we've seen a lot of that really all the, these last two days from a lot of players, leaving a lot of putts short. I got a feeling, though, these greens are gonna, they're gonna ratchet up a notch or two here over the weekend. Jordan Spieth. Well, that reception tells the story. He is a fan favorite here in the state of Texas, just about everywhere he plays. 83rd start of the PGA Tour since his most recent win. That was the 2017 Open. 
Looks like he's setting up to hit a cut. He hit a number of these yesterday, trying to peel it down that left side with a little cut. It did start the left, trying to work back toward the center of the fairway. There you go. Really good. We saw that a few times yesterday. Some really poor approach shots. Ooh. Yeah. Took a look. Yeah. George Spieth walks it in. To stay yeah, right. two back of the lead. What the He's just trying to squeeze here? a fade out there. Yep, all three players in this. Yeah, Jordan has the ability to hit a low penetrating draw that'll, you know, maybe chase up near the front edge, see if he hits it. Up with the left to rider. That's in good shape. Now Jordan, that's got a bite, and it does. Just sneaks out a little further than he would have wanted, but a good shot. There are three tied at eight as we speak. Wow. And he didn't believe that one. Well, actually, two tied at eight. Spieth now at seven. In the hole. He's pulled this. He's going to find that lower level. Yeah, that'll catch the slope and work away from the hole. And as we've seen, not necessarily an easy two putt from there. This one going to be slow early and flatten out and work to his right. Good speed. He doesn't look at the hole anymore on these, and uh, that was always going to be a boogaboo. Oh, that's perfect. Mm -hmm. A good one at the first hole for par. Good one there. Yeah, Jordan. Hang on. Oh! All this right. is trouble right, guys. And they go turkey hunting over there. It is solid trees. It's really thick over there. Oh, they're going even deeper into the woods. Done a nice job of scrambling this week and, made it, and playing himself out of these tough situations. But man, this is going to be one tough place to get it back in play. He's looking at a little window singer that's literally about four feet wide. If he doesn't get enough elevation, it will go right back into these trees here. So a lot riding on this shot. Go. Go. Just cleared him and now back in play. Pretty so he, darn yeah, good. He came into this round hitting just 17 of 36 greens in regulation through two rounds. He's hit just one of three fairways so far today, but that's been speed and it's been to get speed. back. And this is not a whole location you want to get too aggressive with. Just two paces past, it'll run off and off the back edge. All right, Gus did. Go hard. Go. I'll stay there. A smart play right there. Chance for another typical speed par. This might just fall a little to his left. In the hole. So getting this in the fairway, you're exactly right, is a big step in getting things moving in the right direction. This trying to cut back to the fairway, but not going to make it. He's just hoping to land it over there right into the dark green grass short, into that upslope, I guess, now to see so it'll hop on the green. Almost. 
almost. Yeah. That was a nice effort almost, right there. Almost. Still only 27 years old, so we can still let Jordan be young. Look how quick he came out of that one. And not a very good effort there, but pretty shallow. Came in there kind of low. Zing's gonna skip forward. Yeah. So pretty good contact there. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty straight to start, and then right at the end of the putt is gonna try and work just a little bit to his right. Gotta keep the speed up. Still looking for the first birdie. But it's a stress-free par for Spieth. Stays at six under. Wait. Another good looking swing. Mm -hmm, right over the flag stick. Maybe about 12 inches outside that left edge and just try and match that speed up and let it drift over. Oh, didn't hit it. Didn't hit it, had it on line two. Uh, Trying to draw this one, but it's hanging Stay right. Hit it, wind. Stay out of that cactus. And carries the bunker. Very near a tree. All right, so speed situation, Noda. Yeah, he's got 293 to the front, 326, so still a ways to go. Caught a great lie over here. It's propped up. I would have to say it's teed up a little bit. So. The shot's not that difficult to get where I want to get it to. Yeah. And then I think that if it's closer to the green, you can kind of punch it up the green, you know? If yeah. it can get to like 40 out. 270, 270 to that bunker. I just have to cut it into this, you know, I just have to cut a sneaky amount because it's where this tree is. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, and yeah I hear you. He's talking about, you know, where the hole's yeah. cut. It's on a, a very, uh, back shelf of this green, so trying to get something as far up into this fairway as he can to get in a short club into this whole location, if he's able to keep it in the fairway. Good strike, good line. Just how he drew it up right there. It'll be interesting to see if playing it that close to the green that if he can land the ball up on top of that uh, on that shelf and hold it, or if he'll have to try to run something up the green. Jordan Spieth to play first, 87 yards. Should be just a nice lob wedge. Oh yeah, beautifully done. That was the air of his game that he said he had to improve this week. Uh-oh, push. Yeah, that's clutch. He's not too concerned about it. Headed down the left side, got a great kick too. Back toward the center. Yeah, it's time to celebrate if you're Jordan Spieth fans, as there are a few out here. Get in the hole! Gonna hold this back up into this right to left breeze. What a shot. Coming right down the flag stick. That just sounded good. Perfect balance, and Spieth will have a great look at a birdie. Yeah, similar look to the one he had at eight. Looks good. All the way. And he looks up as if finally I've made a putt for birdie. Deep breath. His legion of fans let him know that they are in support of him. Wins in and left to right, which is right-handed golfers. Biggest nightmare. Yeah, this is the toughest wind to drive into here. This is such a beautiful view from up there, up top of that 10th tee. He's just going to be in the rough, but gives him a good angle up the green. And watch this left of the flag, I feel. That was from 177. It's cutting, and this is headed right. Oh, my goodness. Contact there was not good. Back to 10. And after the ruling, Speed now ready to go, Nota. Yeah, a bit of a good break. It wasn't a great lie that he had right next to the sprinkler, so the relief has given him a much better lie chance to get it up and under. He's going to have to create some height with this. Wide open blade. That is how you do it. He's been doing it all week. 
That was so pure. Made it look easy. Now to pay it off. You gotta pay it off here. Are you right? No problem. Oh. Yeah. Spieth at 11, looking to hit his third fairway of the day. He got options here. He, there's two fairways. He looks like he's down in the lower fairway. Sit, Pinky. Sit, sit, sit down. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, I couldn't hit it over there if I tried, but the pin was over there. Yep, he knew it was a tad deep, and he's paying the price for it, rolling further away down the ridge. Back to 11 for Speed's birdie attempt. They continue to urge their man on. Trying to land it right just short a hole high and let it spin back just a fraction. Holds that truck oh. square through the shot. And that's a beauty. An absolute beauty. And delights the crowd here in Texas. Yep. Dead straight, as Nota said. And Jordan Spieth, now just a shot behind. Just sort of been a little bit in between decisions here. Let's see if they calculate right now. Get in the hole. A good looking swing. This might get inside that 10 feet. down that hill a little bit. That's a pretty good shot, I'll say. One of the best for sure. Get in the hole! Oh, just need a little more. Jordan's looking just up the left side, gonna just try and peel one off that left edge. That was a good swing right there. Seems to like it. Oh, yeah, and should. Peels it right down the right side. This is another good looking shot. Right on line. Oh, wow. Oh, uh, that's going to catch that slope. You can tell by the color of the grass. That's the area where the hot green runs away. Dark part is into the grain up the hill, and then once it crests, downhill. A lot of players have left this short. Uh, Note of that, a pretty good judge of the speed. That was an excellent read and great control there. Speed for his birdie. Go. Oh, well, <laughs> those stars out there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it went down. And now tied for the lead, three at the top. Oh, come on. Come on, win. Needs to turn a oh, touch. Oh, give me one bounce. One more. Oh, you got to be kidding me. No, that was the wrong bounce. Oh, kick straight on. You might have expected that to kick left from there. A little unlucky, but a good lie. Jordan, trying to pick that one clean. You sort of spin. This has a good chance. Stay there. Beautiful shot. Jordan Spieth back in a tie for the lead. Three nine at ten under par. There's still some. Wind blowing. You see the flags behind Jordan here. This place pretty short. Yeah, it's up there, Zing. Opting not to use a tee, so 
Gonna try and pinch this a little against the turf, get the desired spin that he wants. Jordan. Uh oh, he knew that thing. Yeah. That's a lot of adrenaline as part of that, you know, even that big birdie at the yeah. last hole. You know, guesstimating. Well, he's in a little bit of the hairy stuff, too, so he's just about getting the speed right. Yep, just going to put it through here. Go, go. And a little work left. Oh. Just. Curled in on the right from four feet nine inches. Quick little downhill putt. And this gonna challenge that bunker up the right. Should cover it though. Yeah, it's got to stay off that cart path though. I don't think it did. And that is not good. When will that stop rolling? Well, it's downhill and it will continue to roll. It's headed for another area code. Jordan and Michael Grell are trying to decide which direction he's going to go, which slope he might be able yeah, to use. I, I kind of feel for Grell here. This is a, this is almost a no-win argument here. Well, noted to me, you have to go. Where are you going, right, Jordan? Michael? Even if he ends up toward the front of the green, he's got a pretty easy shot from there. I mean, if he goes at the hole or even to the right of the hole, he brings that bunker into play, which you do not want to be in. And this is just his second shot here at the par four. As long as I hit it high. Yeah. 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 He's rehearsing a swing that's going to try and elevate this a bit. And I think he's probably opting for the more aggressive line, which will be the more dangerous line here. Go! This could be good, Gary. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, how about that? Wow. And the highlight reel for Spieth is just full of moments like that. I mean, you look at Tiger and all the things he did. This guy has that same kind of knack, right, Gary, for just coming up big when you just need to have something like that. What a birdie. What a birdie for Jordan Spieth. Tied for the lead, 11 under par, shake of the head. <laughs> you know, yeah, it was tough, but I, I pulled it off. Oh, this could be absolutely perfect. Wants to hit it down the right-hand side just like that. Oh, my goodness, he'll reach no problem from there. Solid contact. It's leaking a little. If it covers, it should be okay, though. Oh, and it did. And he <laughs> How about those two by Wallace and Spieth? It big was time it. shots, big time moment of this tournament. I thought it might go hard right on him, Noda, but not really. Oh! Good try. Wow. It looked good for a long time. Oh, I just thought for sure that would fall. We're going to see who has the most self belief tomorrow. That's what it'll boil down to. Five birdies in the last seven holes to finish up. His back nine Saturday. And Jordan Speak, like he's been showing us all year long since that breakthrough 61. I keep thinking of that 61 that just kind of ignited. Jordan Spieth's switch. So as the fans greet Jordan Wallace with his drive up the left side, and it will be crucial for Spieth to feel like he can get off to a quick start finding the fairway. Yep. Yep. Certainly yep. important. All right, come on, let's trust that. This is the third time he's held or shared the lead coming into the final day. That's the most of any player on tour. He's not been able to close the deal, though. So that will be a big storyline today. Finished T4 at TPC Scottsdale when he had a share of the lead. T3 at Pebble. 
from Rancho Santa Fe, California, the 2016 Valero Texas Open champion, Charlie Hoffman. And Jordan Spieth missed the fairway and Noda is on the ground. Yeah, caught a great break over here. Clean shot to the green, great angle from 139. Jordan Spieth was having some discussions with PJ Tour rules official Ken Tackett earlier. Just about a possible concern, a, a crack in his driver. He wanted to know what his options were. Pretty darn good. Yeah, good pace. Good two put there. This one's headed a little left as well, Kurt. So Damn. not able to correct the original miss off the first tee. Yeah, that'll be obviously a layup now for his second shot. Yeah. Good lie, should be plenty of spin. I would say they got it right that time. <laughs> should be able to pick up on that speed a little cleaner. Yeah, this one he doesn't have to worry too much. Speed wise, boy. Good wedge, made it count with a good putt. In the hole! The line's good. So is the distance. Look at this shot from Jordan Speed. Well, Noda, I think uh, the mid iron <laughs> was pretty good there. That'll do it right there. <laughs> yes, it will. All right, Jordan Speed after the best tee shot here at the third today, just two feet five inches. Well, saved the best for last, huh, didn't he? This is uh, straightforward, nothing in this. Ooh, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's in now. So great start by Spieth. A couple of early birdies. He's now the leader at 14 under par. Mm. Headed there again, Noda. Yeah, he got lucky yesterday. He's going to need a little bit of luck on his side again to play his way out of it. The guy down there, the marshal, was giving him the safe sign. I don't know if that means it stayed out of the penalty area or, hey, you're going to have a shot. Now, although he's pitching out, there's a lot of uncertainties here because if this ball hits the ground between him and that cart path, there's a lot of rocks and dirt, and the ball could just pretty much go anywhere. So it's going to take a good one. Well, he got lucky. That kid a rock and kicks straight up and forward. <laughs> So, well, got to take the good breaks when you can get them. Yeah, he knows as well as anybody. And occasionally a good break is what ends up being the difference. Should be a spinny little sand wedge. Okay. Should be turning just about right. Right over the edge of those trees is a good line. There you go. Yeah, sometimes when you putt as well as Jordan Spieth, you don't have to hit it close on every hole. You know, you keep it inside of 25 feet the entire time. Good looks for him. No wind, that's going to be short. No wind at all. Oh, it got there. Well, he called it. He said it'd be a little short, but that doesn't look too bad to me. Five or six years ago, this was a gimme. That's actually a little tentative. So a par there for Spieth. He'll stay at 13 under. And that's exactly what he's done. Beautiful looking tee shots. Yeah, once you put it in the fairway, you've created a birdie hole here now. You can attack with a short iron, maybe even a wedge for his second. 
No doubt about it. And a big chance here for Jordan. Another good chance, actually. Spieth, another one drops at the sixth. Three in the first six holes. The lone blemish at the fourth. And he regains the lead by one over Hoffman. Two over Wallace. Sure is. Come here to write numbers. This is at the left edge of the green. Should be fine. Yeah, it's a good shot. Seems like Jordan has picked up on the speeds better today, but he's going to have to give this one a wrap to get it all the way there. Oh, man, he got it there, too. What a lovely effort. So he will stay one shot in front for the meantime. First two tee shots off one and two were well left. Next driver he pulled out on the fourth went well right. So somewhere in between those would be nice. All right, we'll check it out using a top tracer powered by Top Golf. Yeah. Yeah. That looked a little better. Noda that was it. it up the left. Just got to yeah. bottle that one up and carry it yeah. out the rest of the day. Here we go. It's not a gimme layup, it's kind of tight. Not. Yeah, he's got it down the left side, which gives him a good angle. All the holes cut over on the front right portion of the green. Yeah, the fairway's a little lumpy in there, you know, and his just trickled off into the rough, and that's a difference maker. Speed's third on the way from 74 oh, yeah. yards. Usually very good from this distance, Paul. Third on the PGA Tour in proximity from 50 to 75 yards. Great wedge shot, great putt, and Jordan Spieth to 15 under par now has made 21 birdies this week and most in the field. Shot, oh yeah. That's another beauty right here. Yes, sir. Maybe he's found the groove with a big stick. Well, you know, the key is to remember what your thoughts are. This is a tough one and risky to go all the way back there. So Speed will have a chance for his fifth birdie on this front side. It's coming that's back gonna... down the ridge, though, and that's what he was concerned about. Looked yeah. like it stayed up there for a second. Please. Nine guys, please. Thank you. Missed it by just an inch or two, really. And one thing about Jordan's fall off was he still made some cuts. You know, he wasn't missing every single cut. He just was not playing well at all, and he was very lost and confused. The thing about Jordan, too, is he tells you right where he is. And, you know, he revealed a lot about how uncomfortable he was. Mission accomplished on that front nine. Trying to avoid those trees down the right, and looks like another good one, guys. He's got that driver in the groove after the shaky start. Yeah, or nothing better than striping it off the 10th with a two-shot lead. This is a pretty demanding tee shot. And if you put it in a fairway. Tommy, do not move! Oh, that mud got it a little. Get down. Get on the ground. Oh, that's oh, that. that mud just got it, Michael. Damn it. This is right up Jordan's alley, though. No problem. Yeah. That's pretty clutch. Left side, really, not all that bad. And Greller such, does such a great job of keeping Jordan focused on the important elements. He drew it, and it's going right at that bunker in the middle of the fairway. Like a neon sign. But he flew it with a three wood. Wow. That's a big pop, guys. Yeah, that is crazy long. And a 116 sandwich in his hand, and this is just a nice, full, committed yardage here. Oh, no, this is a, a short and right. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. 
Sorry, man. That was that was my bad. That was a really bad club pull by me. Spieth from the spot he put himself in. Chance to save it. Boy, pretty good shot off that down slope. Perfect inside 10 feet today, Spieth. Add it to the list. Boy, and that is 38 one putts in 65 holes. Yeah, he's going to like that one up the hill. Well, he's really found something as of late, David. Another great swing there. Yeah, another beautiful shot. In the hole! 7,500 people here. Jordan Spieth making them sign like 75,000. The Texan takes the lead by three. And nobody will consider Jordan all the way back unless he wins. Well, this might just validate that. Wow. Oh, thought I had a chance to leak in there, but. Looking for this one to cut it's on yes. the left side. Yeah, it's up the left edge. Should be okay. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> as long as it gets past that tree, which it did, that is fine. Oh, he's right. Well, he likes it. Oh, he gets a very soft bounce. Wow. And that leaves a delicate little. Get your chip there from the front portion. Yeah, it's got to creep it over that hill. Yeah, that's carrying too much speed. Yeah. It's okay. Putting back uphill from there. Hook him, baby. Oh, never a doubt. What a great. Putt at the speed on that, Gary. Mm-hmm. He left it right as well. Oh. oh, now that one may not be so good if that has run all the way up. Cut. Cut. Well, he got a lot out of that. Cut. Sounded pretty clean Come to me. Oh, right wow, there. what Stop. a shot. Golly, that was so close. Right. Yeah, it was. And I'll tell you, that was a great effort from not a particularly good lie. To hit a good one. Let's see how he feels. Just magnificent, magnificent shot. Under pressure. That's the Jordan speed we remember. Asking it to get going. It does. Wanted it to go a little more. It backs up behind Hoffman. Oh, that's a curvy little chip. Did a little hop through there, but he got through it. Two feet, ten inches. Par for Speed, birdie for Hoffman. And game on as they head over to the par 4 17th. And again, you've got the par 5 18th where Eagles are a possibility. Nice. Yeah. Good. Very good. Down the left side. Sets up a good angle for the second shot. Jordan Spieth currently up by one in better position there at the 17th. This is the yardage he's so good at. What a shot. Yep. And another little fist pump. 
now 18 under par, two shot lead, heading to the final hole. Absolutely roasted one here yesterday, ideal. He's been clutch under pressure today. He grabbed the lead in the middle of this back nine and has not let go. Got room over there? Oh. Uh, that's going to need work to go. Seriously? Oh, well, what was that? Yeah. shot to get it up there. Yeah, you make par here, you get it at 18 under, and you make Hoffman hold it out to tie you. Yep, well, Hoffman's then, sitting pretty up there. I think he's got some, uh, he's got some green to work with. Jordan Spieth. In the state of Texas, Jordan Spieth breaks the winless drought. Well, now he can compare himself to who he was today. Good for him. What a win. With his man, Michael Greller. And his wife, Andy, his high school sweetheart in Texas. First win as a husband. Yeah, that's a and big wife. first win. It sure is. What mental attitude did you bring to the golf course today to get this job done? I actually felt really light. I mean, I felt uh, felt like I just wanted to come out and smile, try and have some fun. I mean, that's been kind of a challenge for me is in on these Sundays that I've, when I've been in contention is early on in the round, I've kind of um, just not come out with like a real lightness to me. And I thought today I did. It was nice. I've, I like hanging out with Charlie. I had all yesterday with Matt. So, um, man, I, I just, uh, it's been a long road. <laughs> yeah, it has. And you know, it's hard to win out here on the PGA Tour, although early in your career, you made it look pretty easy, but you have struggled with confidence over the last year or so. That being said, how impactful and gratifying is this victory? Uh, I mean, there were a lot of times I wasn't sure, you know, if, if I'd be here with you, you know, talking to you about this right now. Um, you know, I never really doubted in myself to be able to kind of, you know, get back to where I wanted to go. But when you lose confidence, it's a lot of a lot of times it's hard to see the positive going forward and just kept my head down. I owe a lot of people thanks. I can't wait to tell them um, it's not it's a it's a team and it's a team effort. And I've been blessed to work with the best in the world um, at everything that they do. So uh, this is a, this is a monumental win for me. It's one that you know, I've certainly thought about for a long time. Thanks for watching the PGA Tour on YouTube. Watch another video right here.